Koala. Hi, this is Marek from Elf Audio, and this is a quick tutorial uh, of how to use the MIDI out functionality in Koala. This is only for Samurai, um, and what it lets you do is send MIDI information to uh, external things. So if you have a synthesizer like this Yamaha CS, it's got a, uh, a USB MIDI socket on the back and you can plug your iPad or whatever directly into it. This works on iOS and Android. Um, yes, yeah, so the way you do it is if you go to this samples menu in the bottom right hand corner, there's like a new folder called more and inside more, there's only one thing, which is the MIDI out. Um, and you can either press load to load it, or my favorite thing is to make the file picker not full screen by pressing the chevron. And then you can just drag it to wherever you want it to go. So we'll close that. Um, yeah, so there's our MIDI output. It just looks like any other pad, except it's got a MIDI icon on it. And if we edit it, you can see there's this big section here that says no MIDI out, no MIDI notes. And that's basically just a log of all, all of the MIDI notes that are being sent. It's sort of helpful when you're like trying to work out why your, your synth isn't playing sounds. You can tell whether the messages are being sent out. So it's like a practical thing. And then device lets you choose which device to send it to. So you can either send it to all of your devices. I mean, you might have just one plugged in, so it's kind of a convenience, or you can choose between all the different ones that are plugged in. But we're going to choose this Reface CS, which is this synth I've got here. And you can also choose which MIDI channel you want to send it out on. Uh, but we just stick to one. So if I play this, it's playing sounds, um, send, sending MIDI down the cable, and then the sound is actually coming out of the speaker of the Yamaha Reface. And yeah, if you change the pitch, it will just change the pitch of the MIDI note that's being sent or whatever like that. Same with the volume, it will change the velocity. Um, yeah, so now if we sequence something, I don't know, we can just um, go on the, you know, the piano keyboard in Pentatonic and just record something. So of course that was like with the uh, quantize on, but maybe just try it with quantize off, be a bit nicer. So. And uh, yeah, depending on how you've got it set up, you know, like um, doesn't always work uh, depending on, you know, whether your MIDI is transposed. It's kind of hard to explain, but you should also be able to record MIDI in and then it will send MIDI back out again. So, etc. And then, and then you can use your sense controls to like mess with it. So yeah, that's it. Basically, that's how you do MIDI out with the new MIDI out update for Koala. Thanks a lot. Bye.